Hello everybody on YouTube, Jack the Ripper here, back with more Far Cry 4, and we're finally back with, uh, and we have a helicopter, ooh! Yes please, okay. Uh, we need to do Amita's mission, over here. So I'm gonna fast travel over here, because I don't wanna fly all that way, because I am, uh, yeah, you know. Uh, where is the... let's... quick... oh my god, I got so much stuff now. Holy shit! We have so syringes, I'm gonna sell a bit of stuff, yeah. Refill my ammo... actually, I haven't used that, that much ammo. Let's get in the car and get over there. Oh yeah, I... by the way, I did all the missions for like, uh... The guy that makes clothes, you know. Sadly, I actually w uh, I waited for him to start out like something special, but he had to leave or something like that, so it never happened, which is sad. I was actually waiting for that. I thought I shut off the damn music. Let's see. Music off, yeah, why? Fuck it. There we go, I'm here. So what's my first mission from my real boss now that Amita is uh, in charge? Gone, Madra, you're safe. No more Tarun Matara. Take her back to the camp. I don't know where Sabal is, and I don't trust him. Hello. What's this about Sabal? Not now. We have bigger problems. Bagan's about to hit Utkash with artillery. We can't let that happen. Destroy those cannons before they wipe Utkash off the map. I'm on it. Just remember, I'm not your damn small soldiers, I am actually very important, because I've done a lot of shit for you. So if you are in any fucking way dishonest me, in any way, like talk down to me, anything like that, I'm out. And you lost probably one of your best soldiers that's actually gonna win this shit for you. I'm gonna actually, you know what, if I had a choice, I would go with Peking Min and fucking work with him to kill you. Because, yeah, I'm a douche like that. What? Well, there you go. People say they're difficult to handle, I don't understand why. Let's go and kick some ass. We need to take out, like, the, these artillery cannons. I would wish I could talk to her in the way I would have talked. I would have told her like, you need to listen to me a bit here because I'm as much responsible as Sabal's actions as he is. Because that I helped you. So I want to know right now, right fucking now, if he's a problem. That's, wh that's what I would have said. And if she would have said, you don't decide that, then I would say, okay, who has helped you through all this? Who has made sure we guys are winning now? Yeah, me. You owe me. Oh yeah, you saved, saved my life? Pagan Min was never gonna kill me! <laughs> so again, you didn't save my life actually, you put it at a risk. So actually, they owe me big time. I have no clue where I'm, no clue where I'm going. I just thought shortcut. I'm like the man in the car when his, when his wife says like, "Are you sure this is the right way?" Yeah, I know a shortcut. <laughs> well, it goes well. Ah, road. See, it was a shortcut. I was right. Sabal, you must evacuate 
evacuate that town. I'm not evacuating on your say so. <sighs> I didn't shoot! Fuck this. The first gun's secure. How am I supposed to destroy it? Focus on the soldiers. Help is on the way. Sure, you want to yell that? Direct hit! Direct hit! Soldiers of the Golden Path, I am ordering you to evacuate. Hold your position. Damn it, Sabal! Sabal, you are a fucking idiot. You're killing your men for no fucking reason. God damn it! I need to take care of the rest of the people. That's the last one. So where's that help? It almost at your position. As if we got soldiers right behind us. Okay. Protect the sappers heading your way. They will disable the guns. I really like this glider. It saves a lot of trouble. I am not going to use that. Oh wait, that's a grenade launcher. <laughs> I actually would say this is probably faster and See? Faster and easier. Quickly, you dumbasses! We don't have time for this. Check the sappers. Okay, I guess I have to follow them. Not because I actually need to, because in some ways it would be a lot easier if I just st stood down there and took care of everybody, but meh. Listen to the game, don't listen to yourself, as you usually say. Go boom. Plant those damn charges, we don't have time for anything else. Chopper. 
got it. Over to the next run. This wasn't actually that difficult, the, uh, this mission. It's going pretty easy. Where am I supposed to stand this time? Up on the roofs here? Yeah, that sounds good enough. These are, this gun is really overpowered, like... Okay, I'm running a bit low on ammo, actually. That was easy. Well, I guess that's that. The Valley of Death. I think maybe I should run. That's it. You're in the clear. They would have flattened Utkash if it wasn't for you. <sighs> I don't think people really know how much they owe you, Ajay. No, you're one of them. You've earned yourself a break. <laughs> but a small one. If you have any unfinished business left, I suggest you take care of it. Kirat will need your undivided attention for this final push. Well, I think... Can we take another mission, actually? Amita. Okay, we're going over to Amita to do the next mission. Let's do it. Is this the final mission? Oh, I hope so, because I would like to end this uh, game session soon. I've been gaming all morning with these last few uploads. Damn. We're gonna go to Amita. And, uh, yeah, do the next mission. Sorry, Mr. Elephant. I hit the elephant while in midair. Oops. Yeah, they think that they're gonna do that, but don't worry, I'm not gonna kill Pagan if I get a choice, that's for damn sure. Where is everyone? At the Kalesh. We're getting ready for the final push. This is it. Win or lose. And we're gonna win. Sabal is splitting the Golden Path. He's jeopardizing our future, Ajay. Enough is enough. Are you asking me to... I'm telling you to kill him. I'm being very particular with my words, Ajay. Don't let him snake out of this. Besides, did you really think he was going to be okay with you betraying him and siding with me? No. We can't afford to let Sabal live. Ajay, be careful. The Golden Path needs you. I need you. I'm gonna kill Sabal. I know people are probably gonna hate me for this, but Sabal almost got a lot of our troops killed for no fucking reason, and I actually hate him for that. He could have jeopardized the whole... everything that happened. Everything he did right there, it jeopardized everything we've created. And he's going down for that. I'm gonna fly with this over the river because it's faster. Oh, RJ, I can almost see your furrowed brow from here. Pagan, what do you want? Yeah, it sounds about right, Dad. Oh. I call him Dad now. I'm merely calling to check up on you. I hear your little friends are having a bit of a spat. It must be hard. What was you in the middle of it all? Yeah. Choices are difficult. Trust me, I've been there. In fact, you should be grateful for the choices I've made. Choices like Yuma. I went on live television to serve her up to you, and I know television. Radio is so much more my thing. And you... Opportunity. Poor Yuma, she will be missed. 
It was a tough call to make, picking you over her. But it was the right call. We'll see. Of course, you're in a hurry. Places to go, shit to tear up. I'll let you get back to it. But don't forget, RJ. Choices and consequences. You guys okay? I can't get more karma. I have full karma, so... This is pretty dumb to do. Okay. I want you to know I did not make this decision lightly. The ball will never give up on his beliefs. And if he's allowed to live, it will only be a matter of time before he starts an insurgency of his own. Killing him will help to unify the Golden Bard and prevent a second civil war from breaking out moments after we end our current struggle against Pagan. I know. This is what's right for Kirat. Oh my fucking god, woman. Um. I trust you'll make the right decision. Yeah, that was my fault. I shouldn't have driven in front of those people. <laughs> Kill Sabal. Hey buddy, I'm sorry. Hi. Yeah, he's gonna be mad at me and yell at me. She sent you, brother. Did you volunteer? What do you think you're doing? Killing you because you you're dick. Shit on everything your father built. Congratulations. Uh, no, no, I didn't because my father didn't build much besides the house everything that I live in. But uh, is irrelevant thanks to you. And that's what's truly sad, brother. You handed over everything to a Because she's trying to save the country. Not. Yeah. You think she can fix Kirad? How? Drug fields as far as the eye can see. Suicide nets in factory towns where men, women, and children are free to be poor. <sighs> it's a land of equal opportunity where everyone's a slave. Religion isn't that different, you know. You would make everybody believe in your you damn religions. The your mother wanted ashes to be scattered. Yeah, I think so. Listen to me, buddy. This fucking world is fucked over, and you're done for. Bye. I took care of Sabal. I can't believe it. I'm sorry, Ajay. It, it had. It had to be done. I don't give a fuck. It had to be done. Where are we going now? Is it the last mission? Well, everyone, I am gonna end it here. The next mission, the next episode, maybe the last. So be ready for that. Everybody, have a nice day.